Now, the 90-day ban on logging in community and public forests has been extended by a further six months. Environment Cabinet Secretary Kiriako Tobiko says this is to allow the sector get back on its feet following unsupervised timber felling in the forest. Business owners have, however, expressed that this will cripple what is left of their timber businesses. For the hundreds of Kenyans earning a living from the timber business, the extension of the 90-day ban on logging in community and public forests for the next six months is a traumatic pain. The new order shattering the remaining rays of hope for the businessmen who had to endure major losses soon after the 90-day ban was first implemented on the 24th of February this year. So millers wana wana teta pesa nini miti yao ilifungiwa they had already paid to say me sisi file file saa hii wamefuga miezi sita tena jaa yetu itaongezeka maisha yetu itakuwa mzito kwa sababu hata tukitokea kwa hii ngeti tunashidwa tutaenda wapi Joseph Muridi dived into the timber sector business 6 years ago one that happened to turn into a fortune enabling him to support his family through the hard economic times he, just like the rest in the industry, is reading from the same script. Wakati moratoria muirigia tulikuwa na bank loan. Na hiyo yote sasa hata hatulipi. Eh, sasa ni barua imeanza kama mimi nimeletoa barua tayari. Sababu ya ukoza kulipa instrument ya msbiri. In his timber yard, the deafening silence has now become normal. The section that was used to store piles of sewn timber now remains empty with pieces of rotten timber. The sewing machine lying idle as if to parade its sharp blades and ones that within the next six months may lose its worth. For Agnes Wangoi, who is a manager at one of the timber yards in Nyeri, the ban she says will cripple what was left of her family's business. And even with harvesting allowed in private forests, the quality of the trees do not compare with those in the natural forests. They don't actually dry up or the joints don't come up, come up or add up. It was mostly used from 8x2 and the 6x1 and 6x2s. Right now what is available, we are only having the 8x2 sizes and you can't complete a bed without the 6x1 or a 6x2. And uh, so it is so hard for us. The initial 90-day ban was arrived at by the government to allow for reassessment of the management of the forest sector in Kenya, following serious concerns of wanton destruction of Kenya's ecosystem. The six-month extension, according to CS Kiriako Tobiko, will allow the appointment of the new board of the Kenya Forest Service and the finalization of the Interim Reforms Implementation Committee. However, for workers and business owners in the timber business, it will be a bitter pill to swallow as they'll continue to count bigger losses. Raquel Mugai, KTN News.